A GnRH analog agonist is administered nasally or subcutaneously from day 21 of the menstrual cycle. Following an initial flare effect of LH, pituitary release of LH is suppressed, thus preventing premature ovulation of the follicles during stimulation. Around the time of menstruation, a scan is performed to check the thickening of the endometrium of the uterine cavity and rule out the presence of cysts in the ovaries. If everything is normal, subcutaneous daily injections of FSH is initiated. This hormone facilitates the growth of the follicles in the ovary. The dosage is established for each patient and is adjusted in consecutive checks. The objective is to have four to seven follicles grow per ovary. At the end of approximately four to six days of stimulation, another scan is performed to check the number and size of the follicles, as well as the quality of the endometrium. Every two or three days a new scan is performed. When at least three follicles have grown to the size of at least 18 millimeters, final follicular maturation is triggered with the hormone HCG. The ova that are within the follicles will begin to mature. Oocyte recovery is undertaken 36 hours later. Following the procedure, a daily supplement of the hormone progesterone is given vaginally. Two to five days after oocyte recovery, the embryos are transferred. Two weeks later, a pregnancy test is performed.